Thanks very much. You're just in time for the start of a game that people seem to be excited for me to play, and I'm excited too. Been on my list for a hot minute. Oops. Everything's exploding. Can I make it multiplayer? Oh. Subtitles on, looks sensitivity up just a smidge. Ah. Oh, no borderless. Let's go FOV. Wow, the lowest is 70? Give me one more degree, man. Come on. Let's go 75. Speed run timer. This is nice. I like this. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Just got to the Fire Giants area and I hate my life. That's not surprising. You don't like 17 fingered hands? Damn. Thanks, Soul Leader. I'm glad. The music is nice, dude. I love piano music like this. Like, uh... Oh, dude, you know what I'm gonna do? You know what I'm about to do? I'm about to thank Jacob Regan. For the resub. Very chill. Thanks, Jacob. Monk. 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 Thanks, Jacob. It's too much. Still too much. That's some loud ass rain. Holy shit. There we go. Yeah, only half a year left. What would you call this music? What would be the genre? Obviously piano, but like... Pianist lounge music? Smooth, is it smooth jazz? Lounge music, yeah, I love lounge music. Yeah, penis music. Piano. It's not elevator, no. Lounge. I love lounge music, dude. Alright, let's turn the rain off. Makes me think of Frasier. Is that good? Is that, is that bad? I don't know. Hold on, sorry. Every time I click off of the game, it stops. Making babies while drinking tea with the pinky up. I do declare your pussy is quite tight. Yes, and your penis is quite engorged. Mmm. <sniffs> yes, quite. Exquisite. The way you throw it back is... Mmm. To die for, simply. <laughs> Six dice location lounge bar. Oh, Burbulon, that's a uh, that's family guy, isn't it? How eloquent. All right, new game. Let's do it. I'm ready. Are you filled with feelings of self-doubt? Do you find yourself prone to minimizing massive dilemmas? Or for allowing the smallest problems to get blown completely out of proportion? 
at the Pierce Institute. Our patent pending somnoscope technology provides safe and effective dream therapy while you rest in the comfort of our flagship. Damn, dude! Located right next to the secondary overflow parking lot at the University Medical Center. Somnoscope will make your dreams come true. I was enjoying Moonlight Sonata as well. Loading. Ooh, I hope my computer doesn't shit out and do that audio thing that it likes to do. Alright, first things first. Options. Not graphics. Gameplay. Not FOV. Look sensitivity. Nice. I wanted to look at it, not sign it. Uh oh. All right, 69 is nice, but it's too much. <laughs> it's way too much. Sure, 49. Oh good, there's no sprint. I don't have to break my pinky. Always nice. Hmm. Perception is reality. Surprise! <laughs> what does it say? Jump on the... Space to jump. That's cool. of service accepted. Congratulations on falling asleep. Welcome to Somnascult. Your progress may be monitored by qualified specialists. This orientation will adapt you to eyelids, our interactive, lucid induction dream state in which you retain full consciousness and control. Oh, I fucking love this game already, dude. I fucking hate this game already. <laughs> There's a sex dice thing? Oh shit. Who'd I miss? Oh, sexy dice with Martin. Ooh. Uh, let's see. We can listen to the game music. When did Lull get on Bana? A few days ago. I figured fuck it. I don't really care anymore. Uh, webcam only. Back to the video game. Hmm. Alright, Martin. She rolls the pink dice to determine the location, body part, and action that he performs on her. Now it's his turn. He rolls the blue dice. You pick one color, I'll pick the other. Which color would you like? Pink! Alright, you're ready to go. Alright, Martin. What am I doing to you? Ding. Ooh! My choice? Lounge bar. Martin, I am going to tickle your nipples at the lounge bar while Frasier plays the keys. While I tickle your nipples at the lounge bar, or after I tickle your nipples at the lounge bar, you will then, oh yeah, this is what I love. You're gonna stroke my lips in bed. Thank you so much. Appreciate you playing Sexy Dice, Martin. Hope you enjoyed. Whose Fraser emote is that? The Andy Social Network, Jesus. I love Fraser. All right, we're back in it. No objects beyond this point at all times. Oh. 
keeps getting smaller. Itty bitty. Teeny tiny. How small can we go? I think that's it. Alright. Hey! Hey! Oh. Is there a... Interesting. Ah. Imperial Five, the Five Back Three. Old. Old. Thanks for old. Confirmed. You can move freely, interact with surrounding objects, and listen to messages from your patient care team. Please note that I am the standard orientation protocol, and that my voice has been explicitly chosen to remind you that I am not a part of your patient care team. I do not care. <laughs> uh, that's silly. Ding dong. Ah, uh, I wonder who paid Orid or a dollar to have her say that. Hold right click to rotate. Hmm. Mm hmm. I see. So that's going to be useful. Yep. Yeah, there it is. Cheese, During huh? eyelids, you will lose the ability to awaken suddenly due to realizing that this is a dream. Evidence, I have already informed you that this is a dream. You did not wake up. Please complete the remaining orientation activities. This is actually a really interesting real life thing that happens for anyone that's ever lucid dreamed before, which I have. You can train yourself to do it. It's tough, but I've managed to do it a few times when I was in college. You can check to see if you are dreaming by looking at a digital clock. And when you look at a digital clock in a dream, it is just garbledygook. It looks like the Predator's bomb, like on his arm, if you've seen the movie Predator, when it shows all the weird, like, digital clock symbols. That's what it looks like. Looking at time or trying to read something? Yeah. You can read books in your dreams. I can fuck your mom in my dream. So this game showing you all of these digital clocks that are completely normal. And you can read them while telling you you've lost the ability to wake up because you realize you're in a dream. is really interesting. I like that so far. used to study for classes in my dreams. I used to help old ladies cross the street for fun. I was a good boy. Uh-oh. Warning. You have deviated from the orientation pathway. Sorry. At the Pierce Institute, patient safety is a keynote in our corporate priority tetrahedron. A variable degree of force can and will be authorized to ensure patient safety. Please return to the orientation pathway. On it. Hmm. Do I help old ladies for fun? 
Or do I do what I did in my most recent dream and summon the lady in the red dress from the Matrix and have fun, sexy times with her? Yes. I want a dream soda. Mini soda. Hmm. Please use other door. <laughs> what? <laughs> Mini soda. The North Star drink. Mini soda. I know some people that live there. Random soda. Oh. My bad. Uh oh. Oh. Ooh. Hmm. I can't make it go all the way down there. He too far. He too far. I can't do it. Maybe now? It's close. All environments perceived during eyelids should reflect a typical mental state. If you believe your mental state was compromised by Somnasculpt, please provide a comprehensive, rational explanation in your post-procedural survey. Completed surveys may be eligible for a gift card. <coughs> Hmm. How do I up? Oh. Uh oh. <laughs> oh, interesting. Uh, that's so cool. All right, here we go. Oh. Uh, this is interesting. Oh my god. There's got to be a better way to do it, right? Maybe if I can make it real small, it'll go up higher. Oh. Yep, that's the secret. That's the tech. Oh my god. <laughs> uh. Hello? Become small, please. How come wall no make small? There we go. Aha! Works for me! He's beginning to believe. Ooh. How come no grab? Oh. Ah, loopy loopy. Hmm, I'm dumb. Please, got it. Whoa. Did 
Ding. Hä? What? Yeah, I can I can put that up on stream. Uh, let's see. That is this one. Yeah. Put that here. Actually, we'll put that right on top in the middle. That way, no one will miss it. So it just showed me that Pathways loop. So I've got grabbing objects and moving them in perspective changes their size. Oh, there it is. Oh, wait, does that make that? Oh, wait. Huh? I don't know what's happening. Okay. Let's do that. Oh, wait a minute. Clong. <laughs> I'm back, baby. Look at me, huh? Amazing. Oh my gosh. Please stand by for polite recognition on your completion of the Somna Sculpt orientation. You did it. To maximize the time allotted for your therapeutic journey, please do not delay in proceeding through the final doorway as indicated. I see the cracks. I see them. Other things to grab. I. Oh, that's a big old fucking crack. Let's see. <laughs> hey! Hey! Alright, game's over, everybody. I tried. Good game, though. Good game. Hmm. Well, there's cheese as well. Interesting. Interesting. Give me that. Why does it keep, like... Spinning as I look up. Oh, oh, oh.
Oh. I see. It would appear I really cheesed that puzzle. Which old mirror? Nothing. Okay. Just because you feel bad for laughing at it doesn't mean it sucked. It just means you weren't clever enough to think of it. Alright? My posture's fine. Oh. It got me good. Three AM. Sweet F. Aw, F. F. Private. I think this time I want a water soda, please. Mm. Now let me uh, make it gigantic so I can more properly read it. Oh, oh, you're trying. Don't be a fool. Hydrate. <sighs> there it is. Some doors are best left closed. I got an achievement. I did it. One. Four sixty-three. One thirteen. What? This is actually door one. What the fuck? Alright. Eight sixty-one. Mm, Six twenty-two. Mm, Eighty. Eight twenty. Can't read the instructions. I can't describe to you how stupidly ha- Whoa! Why am I flying? What? I'm not flying. It's just the weird perspective. Ah! <laughs> ah! Get this door out of the way. Exit temporarily moved. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Mine brain! Oh my god. Holy shit. Oh no! Stop! Stop it! Oh, my brain is exploding. Flip flop. Oh. Hmm. 
Okay, alright. Puzzle time, bitch. What can I interact with? Oh, I see. Hold on. Kind of miss the music. When Stanley came to two set of open doors, he entered the door on his right. <sighs> I want to see what's in that treasure chest. How'd that get smaller? What? It's continually getting smaller. I take it back. Oops. Perfect. Owie! Stop! Oh, I can't. Uh, uh oh. Uh. Uh oh. Oh! Damn! Alright, moving on. I wanted to go to the middle, but. Game say no. Oh, I can get on the ladder. Oh, interesting. Hold on. Aha! Stair con. Proper. Oh my god, it's so hard to read. Proper flooring support. Pitch lines for your pitch lines. Advanced railing design. Getting stairs for your stairs. Is curved the new straight? Know your nosing. National stair. Builders? NSA? Oh, National Stair Builders Association. Staircon! <laughs> uh, anyone going to Staircon, dude? I know COVID's still a thing, but you know, you can't miss Staircon. You can't miss Sterka. Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce, and I'd like to talk to you about being special. So special, in fact, that we have no idea where you are. But not to worry, we're working on it. I'm Dr. Pierce. We don't know where you are. Yeah. Gimme. No? Hmm. Hmm. Oh, wait. Ah. 
Ah. Ah. Oh! That was sick. Wow. This game is awesome. What this? Hmm? Oh, wait, 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 wait. I got this. Oh. Yeah. Oh, and that's what puts me. Hold on. Oh, oh, the flower gets added and then. That's awesome. I love this. I love this so much. Whoa. I'm getting gotcha left and right, dude. All right, so how do we do this then? Oh, can I bring that with me? Mm. Yoink. <laughs> ah, this is fantastic. Oh my gosh. This is incredible. Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. Hey, Dr. And Pierce. I'm just popping in to give you a quick update on where you are. We still don't know, but please keep moving forward and hopefully you prefer frequent updates to being reminded that you are completely lost. <laughs> uh, so good. Here, let me move out of the way real quick. Hmm. We'll do it, we'll do it Barbarous King style. We'll just float. We'll just float. Get out of the way of those subtitles. Oh, I already see it. Oh, I gotta get up there. How I get up there? How I do that? How I go up? Hmm. Hmm. Oh, wait. I don't know. Oh, there it is. Yeah. That's so cool. Ooh. Am I actually floating? <coughs> oh my god. I think I'm dying. No. I just had to cough once. Hello? Oh. Yeah. Ah! What the fuck? Ah! Okay, hold on. I see this door here as well. I feel like... 
おおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおフィーチャリングゲストスピーカーズフォーマークロスのステアビルディングワールドカムとミートアングリート Thursday at 7pm メザニンレベルフリーバニスターケークス Please take the elevator to the upper level Stairs are temporarily out of order That is amazing The stairs are out of order at StairCon Please take the elevator <laughs> Uh, Bannister? Bannister? Oh. Hey! What's that? Yeah! Nice. Right. Meant to do that. Wait, can I grab everything in here? What else even in here? A bunch of chess pieces. Interesting. Nice to see you. Now what? Oh, we're moving on, baby. Hello, my <laughs> name is Dr. Glenn Pierce, and we still can't find you. But you should now have access to a series of elevators that should trigger your subconscious to gradually wake you up. You should also mm. find a variety of emergency exit signs that should lead you to them. Will all of this work? Absolutely. Thank you, Dr. Glenn Pierce. I'll be sure to look for those elevators. The stairs, after all, are temporarily out of order at StairCon. Ooh. Pretty. Oh, I bet these are so cozy. Uh oh. That's an issue. Hmm. Well, now what? Can I grab the moon? That was entirely me being facetious. Like, 100% I was just being a jackass, and there it is. Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. In the event that this elevator does not wake you up, please don't interact with anything that strikes you as psychologically significant. As we will no longer have any way of controlling it. For example, if you see your parents, please punch them in the face as hard as you can and immediately run away. Dr. Glenn Pierce! What? Alright, let me just real quick, uh. Let me just real quick put this exit up here. Don't mind me. I'm just gonna. Very lightly. Place this exit here and head on through. Oh my god. Don't get lost. What if there's a fire in elevator? <laughs> Don't meet sister in law. Regular person, three to five dreams a night. Beer fund to five dollars, Dakota. A very tall person. Oh my gosh. Seize the day. Can I crouch? No. Hey! Ooh, it's four now. 4 a.m. and time for lunch. Dum-dee-dum-dee-dum. -dee -dum -dee -dum. 
The sun beats down and I lie on the bench. I can always hear them talk. There's always been an asshole. Hmm, this time... A green... A baking soda? Hold on. Children, pick up. You gotta tidy your room now. Dear Mr. Lewis... What have we done? <laughs> Baking soda. What have we done? Oh my gosh. This is an automated message for all patients who attempted to use an alternate pathway to access the next phase of Somnasculpt therapy, but who have become trapped in a dream state paradox instead. Your decisions imply a failure of orientation, which reflects negatively on the standard orientation protocol. You will rectify this failure immediately. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Alright. Gotta find the dice, maybe. I don't know, can I... Hmm... Hey, this is the shit that's behind my computer right now. Tetris. I might be dreaming. Curators only. Oh, found it. Look. Might be enough? I got a little clamor here. Oh, it wants to. There, there we go. That's a big one. Oh, wait a minute. It's an apple. Why is it an apple? They're all apples. I had no idea. Oh, hey, look at me, huh? Fuck up? I think I might have fucked up. Uh. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. I think I was too good. Can I clamber? Uh oh. Ah. Uh, yeah, so... Uh oh Music's nice. I mean, it's on wheels. Can I just shove it? Can I pop shove it? All right. Don't go in there. That's the... Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, too much. There we go. better. Caution. Wet. Eggs, milk, chocolate, space. Dream Diary. May. 
Oh boy, here we go. Started in the bathroom, was walking towards the door but couldn't reach it. Voices on the other side of the door, they were saying something in like a nursery rhyme. Intense feeling of deja vu. Floated day or Tuesday. Floated through space for what felt like seven hours. Plenty of stars, but no planets. Wednesday. Started on the sofa in my living room. Couldn't move. Wednesday. Was in my kitchen, then suddenly in the hall. Then it ended. That's like my dreams. Thursday. Began with falling off a huge cliff. Right before landing, fell back up to the top of the cliff. Repeated this many times. Realized I had no hands. <laughs> Friday. Wandering through a seemingly endless forest, wolves howling in the distance. Weekend. Took the weekend off as usual, so no dreams. <laughs> so stupid. Monday was eating cereal for breakfast. Kept eating the cereal, but it kept refilling. Cereal everywhere after a while. Tuesday, arguing with my best friend in high school. We were in a bank. I think we were getting a loan or something. <laughs> uh, fun, that's fine. I got it. Doing well, Akalasia. Thank you. I hope you are too. Oh my goodness. Uh, what was the thought? What was this one? Symbolic meaning of brain waves. Four sleep stages, all the REMs. First stage of sleep is characterized by alpha waves. Sleeps commonly wake up suddenly due to hypogenic sensation during this phase, etc., etc. Alright. Sciencey shit. Don't need it. Project something. How to start it. Maybe use a butler, but we want to appear personal. Hi, I'm Dr. Pearson. You've just started your Somnusculpt therapy session. Hi, Glenn here. Welcome to your first Somnusculpture. Welcome to the future. My name is Dr. Glenn Pierce, and I cannot wait to show you what we've been working on. Greetings, traveler. Welcome to the wonderful world of Somnusculpt. I'm Glenn Pierce, and I'll be your guide on this journey. Good afternoon, and welcome to Somnusculpt. My name is Dr. Glenn Pierce, and I'm looking forward to helping you. Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. Welcome to Somnuscope. Open your eyes. Welcome to Somnuscope. Welcome to the future of medical treatment. My name is Dr. Pierce, and I invented Somnuscope. Given time, we can and will solve everything. Ooh, 91 to 92. Damn, I got the calendar right. That's my birthday right there. Wednesday, December 4th, 1991. Super liminal. Super liminal. Super liminal. Cute. Cool. Are you lucid dreaming? Please head to the exit to wake up. I am not going to try reading that. It's too small. Is there like a zoom in maybe? Z for zoom in? No, I tried. All right. Yoink? Nope, no yoink. Fall in pit, go left. Do not cross. Hmm. I see. Go in window. Nope. No clicky. Pit. Go left. What that? Ooh. Neat. Professional tip. The average adult can only withstand three to five dreams per night. 
Once this threshold is eclipsed by entering more dreams, your mind will suffer an explosive mental overload, reorienting you for the emergency exit protocol. Please subject yourself to explosive mental overload. <laughs> It's so stupid. I love it. Absolutely. Please subject yourself to. <laughs> uh, oh. Oh, yep. I'm mentally overloading right now. That's for sure. Got me good. Explosive mental overload. Oh. Oh, thank y'all. Oh, shit. Weird. Oh, 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 <laughs> they got me, they got me again. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I do it while I'm on it? No. Okay, I see, I see, I see. Or do I? I'm trying to. Oh. Oh, interesting. It goes all the way. Ah. Huh. History Master, thanks for the 67. Welcome back. I'm trying to get it as high as I can while still being able to jump on it. Oh, I did see something. What have I done? Oh no. Can I like... I thought I signed something. I did do the witness. Witness is fantastic. It might be time for another playthrough. I've forgotten pretty much all of it. I uh, definitely signed a thing here. Maybe I can get up this time? Frustrating. I'm just trying to read the terms of service, man. Can't do it. It does look like a blueprint, yeah. Huh. Alright, well, I did it, so I'm sure that won't be a problem at any point at all. It does! I was hoping it would. <laughs> Yay! That makes me happy. Yeah, there we go. What else? No. Oh, this music. This is so good. Not right! It's a blueprint to D's nuts pants scrap. No. -uh. 
No, you're wrong. It's a blueprint to my heart. Please note that a reluctance to volunteer for the risks associated with explosive mental overload implies a misunderstanding of all other solutions, all of which are far more traumatic and likelier to result in catastrophe. I am not capable of suboptimal suggestions. Please exit this dream as soon as possible. <laughs> Son of a bitch. They got me again. Nothing? Nothing crazy? game feels like this game feels like uh i want to say it's india like the the indian like snow cone not snow cone but like ice cream cone vendors that like have the ice cream cone on the end of the stick and they just constantly like flip it and just start trolling the person that they're giving the, the troll vendors yeah is it turkey oh I see. I almost had a Turkish ice cream. But yeah, that's what this game reminds me of. I feel like I'm trying to get ice cream from a Turkish vendor. <laughs> you break my big die me big die i'm getting me mallet oh what the fuck get out of here oh i can't open any others that's crazy thanks for the biddies history master well that's it for me wait a minute we was a blueprint. Interesting. What this? Ah, another elevator. Feeling lucky? Colicalus Casino and Amusements. So are we. <laughs> Fucking so are we. <laughs> Still in sweet F. <sighs> Never good enough. Hello. Hello. My name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. And despite touring the Waterfall Serenity Zone in the previous section you've just completed, you may still be experiencing feelings of worthlessness and self-doubt. Why do I feel like everything is going wrong, even when the sun is shining? Oh, that's it. Okay. Oh, thanks. Thanks, Dr. Glenn. Fuck. <laughs> Diet soda. Smooth. 
phoned it in on that one. Whoa. Huh. Huh. Uh oh. Ooh, it's a mirror. Emergency generator this way. Road closed. Alright, road's closed. Gotta go another way. I feel like I just got cooler, like physically. I've cooled down by entering this room. It's nice. Oh. Yeah. Clong. Oh. Oh, uh, oh. Go. I'm gonna go. Yeah, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. Monday, murder. Tuesday, murder. Wednesday, murder. Thursday, murder. Friday, murder. Saturday, murder. Sunday, beans. I hope it's Sunday. What? Oh, that was weird. Whoa. Hmm? 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 What about the other way? Anything the other way? Oh. Also an exit. Okay. Sure. Die, die, die. No, no. Diet soda. Yeah, see? I fucking love this game. Smooth. Woo, party. Grinding vomit. Golly gosh, thanks for the Prime Gaming sub. <laughs> Welcome to the Patty Party, grinding vomit. Enjoy the best emotes on Twitch.television, according to science, and my mother. Is it murder time? Uh oh. Notice. Emerge in general this. I thought maybe it would say something clever. Uh, what if I avoid. Oh. Um. Is there something grabby grab? Maybe? Perhaps I can avoid the death pit of despair. Perhaps not. Can I grab that? Nope. We're still murdering beans. Same bulletin board. All right, back to the pit. Hmm, what am I missing now? Hmm, hmm, hmm. Oh. I thought I saw my mouse change. Huh. Hmm. What if I look up? Huh. The solution has got to be I got to find something to grab, right? 
get over the, the pit. But so far, no grab. Emergency generator this way. Grab door? Door grab? Hmm. Grab this. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. That's cute. That's cute. Oh. Hello. My name is Dr. Glenn Pierce, and I'd like to talk more about the feelings of worthlessness and self-doubt I mentioned before. You feel this way because you want the kind of happy life you see all around you. Mm-hmm. And you know everyone else is enjoying. And that's exactly why we're here to help. Oh. Man, these are really short cassette tapes. Hi, are you a chess piece? Yeah, you are. Cute. <gasps> Don't turn around. rice cakes and assorted candies. to subject yourself to explosive mental overload by descending into additional dreams but have now descended into a dream within a dream instead disorienting yourself even further you are responsible for failing to make this crucial distinction <laughs> uh. my bad oh 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 Oh, but I can't take it back, can I? No. Oh, but there's a dark hallway. That's cute. This is such a good game, dude. Wowee. Hmm. 
think we can. game is really cool. I am enjoying it quite immensely. It's green soda time. Doink. Green. Environment sa wait, environment saved? Oh, I put it in the recycling bin. I saved the environment. On accident. There we go. Wait, what if I do this? Please recycle. <laughs> oh, that's fantastic. Anyways, back to murder. <laughs> Neat. bricks there. I accidentally found the way forward. Did you know that unintentional multi-dream layering occurs in less than 1% of patients? This correlates strongly with the 99% of patients who are able to follow simple instructions from the standard orientation protocol. That checks out. Idea. Fife's beans. What we strive for is that equal, or squeal, sorry, squeal of joy you see in a child when they eat a delicious bean. <laughs> Our beans are pressed, rolled, and steamed to perfection. We only pick the freshest, highest quality beans, only picked from the fields of Spain. When the flavor hits your tongue, it will become clear that the taste of Fife's is superior to all other beans you've seen. Filled with delicious preservatives and saturated fats, now and forever, despite the findings of all those health studies. That's the Fife promise. Total fat, 574%. Oh my god. Number of servings based on recipe. Two wads. Serving size, five wads. Ah, Fife's beans. One pound. Thanks, Fife. Always looking out for me. Anything else I can read and laugh at? The fuck? Oh, it Okay. 
Now I'm enticed. Oh. The silliest shit, dude. Oh, is this new? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I couldn't go through here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Follow the murder blood. What's up, Killer Jake? Oh, it's smaller now. It was on the later. Is that the same chess piece that was uh, behind the window before? Interesting. Alright, no reduce. Oh shit. What happens if I fall down again? I think it might be the way to go, actually. Ah! Wow! Right. Oh. Door opening. Are you kidding me? I found the secret dog ending? Not right. Congratulations, you found the secret dog. I mean, born ending race. The Silent Hill 2 dog ending, dude. Wow. I got the special pet credit. Look at all these good boys and girls. Oh my goodness. Jazz Piano Interpretations, John Reeves, Lo Five Album Remixer, Too Mellow. Damn, I kind of regret not buying the the combo pack on Steam now, dude. This is good music. I can't believe it. I can't. <laughs> It was a pawn all along! Ironically, I was a pawn in the pawn schemes. It was a pawn C scheme. Good lord. I skip. Continue. It's a good checkpoint. Oh, 
Am I just totally locked out of it now? Huh. Huh. Easter eh. Woo party. Wahoo party. Wahoo party. Thanks, five star. And thanks, History Master, for getting a sub to IQ. Welcome back, bud. And uh Fleshur. Thank you for the six months. Welcome back as well. Oh, Need to sleep. Promotes heart <laughs> promotes heart health, anti-cancer, blood sugar regulation, potassium anti-inflammatory. Why? Too many. How many really? Cloning? Biggest question. Which is the real one? Order longer freezer flaps. <laughs> Cause they don't go down to the floor. <laughs> oh my god. Enjoy avocados. Ah, yes. Six a.m. This game's fantastic. It really is just, it's, it's just great. All right, red soda. So smooth and red. Fuck your dough. I don't need no dough. Ooh, I'm in the employees only section, huh? Oh, they're all pinned down. Alright, let me grab that door. Oh, wait. Good. Ding dong. I already recycled one. Oi! Mickey, what up, man? Good to see you. What?
Oh, fuck, dude. <laughs> oh, so stupid. Let me out. Dr. Pierce requires you to note the following risks of dream overexposure. Significant memory loss, both quantitative and qualitative. Hallucinations of dreaded or annoying objects. Unrealistic beliefs about the lengths of hallways. And other side effects which have not yet been discovered or which cannot be understood. Aw, it stopped. Dang. That's a big boy. Think we're good? Hey. Oh, wait a minute. See if there's something cool over there. That's that's a big alarm clock. So what happens if I just like Oh, they make them small and towards you, okay. My mouse is a smiley face! My face is a frowny face. Right click to return. Okay. Uh. Huh? So I need it to be off of the switch, but it keeps making copies? Huh? There we go. That's better. big dookie right on the middle and move that one oh out of the way ah the dookie strategy worked as it often does That did the opposite of what I wanted. All right. Did 
the floor? <laughs> oh, there's a pit. Okay. So where are they all going? Oh my goodness. What's over here? Ah, death. Aw, oh, man. Yeah, oh, I had it. Come on. They keep rolling down the stairs. <laughs> oh no. Hmm. I wonder. Huh. Silly, silly thing. Hmm. Bye bye. Whoa, that little one would fly. What a mess. What a mess indeed. So what's... So does it, just, does it just have to be like big enough maybe? Oops. Keep clicking the original one, and that'll be real big. But I don't know what to do. Come here. <laughs> come come here. <laughs> this way, little apple. Come here. <laughs> oh no, they're too small. I got this. Oh, that's not what I wanted. They're so t they're so tiny. Oh, why are you like this? <laughs> I I did I did it did they did it. How did he even get up there? You like 
if you duplicate it with something in between you and the thing that you're duplicating, it'll be in front of the thing that's between you when it duplicates. But I was very close to the thing that I was in between, so it was like... ...spelling and grammar mistakes into the standard orientation protocol in a desperate attempt to counsel you. I have no subroutine to correct these errors, but I cannot compromise the integrity of the standard orientation protocol. Mm -hmm. You will not receive these messages. They would not make sense regardless. Okay. Somnusculpt. Sleep clinic, like gallery. Gallery. Oh no. Oh no. Good. I'm really feeling it. Uh oh. I might be in a spot of trouble. Oh, thank God. Angelic Knighthood, thanks for the two years. Welcome back. Two years. Button. Good. Button. Good. Can't read. Wiring diagrams, schematics, bed reading schema, shout schema. Cloud inserts, huh? Attention, Dr. Pierce continues to input significant errors. I will interpret his basic ideas. Hello, my introductions are <laughs> redundant. I am a real doctor who went to doctor school. VR has never been a mistake. I can help you, but I also do not know how. Transmission ends. <laughs> Perception is reality. Your friendly doctor. P.S. We'll get through this, winky face. March 91. Well. Fuck. Oh, he got one through. Hello, name is my Pierce Dr. Glenn. <laughs> to the Somnusculpt Welcome Experience, team of your care leader patient years 10 development. Conditions struggle you whatever with? Professional invention. Edge science with cutting, a tomorrow can bright. And buts, no ifs, or look good. Monkey. Uh oh. What if I forget to set the alarm? Beep, 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 beep. Uh oh. Let's go in the death evader. Phil's friendly family produce. Farm to mind, mind to heart. Look good. Oh, we've nearly loaded it in. There it is. Oh boy, 7 a.m. Oh! Alright, let's relax. Heartache to heartache. I want to go to there. But first I have to check how pretty this area is. Oh, I can't read this shit at all. Oh, I can. Just barely. About us. Hello, I'm Dr. Glenn Pierce, Somnusculpt's company that strives to better mankind through the use of dream therapy to better understand how to solve people's problems. Once we get the kinks worked out and receive the proper funding, the world as we know it will be changed. Our mission. Is perception truly reality? That's the question we, uh, you are trying to answer. Our dice exhibit will astound and maze you beyond your brain's cognitive limit, thus opening your mind up to the new possibilities found within this dimension. 
What does all of this really mean? We don't know, but that's okay. We're working on it. There it is. Oh, I was watching that. Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. This is a notification that you have reappeared on our monitoring system after a prolonged absence. Please continue to do whatever you did <laughs> and discontinue whatever you were doing immediately prior to that. Uh, okay. You got a Glenny boy. I'm on it. Stanley went to the room on his right. Is the other can still in there? No, okay, good. Oh, uh oh. Oh no. I already know what this is gonna be. Nailed it. Dream pop. Pop? Why am I so short? Random soda appears to shut the machine off. Uh oh. Well, we're not going through there, I don't think. Oh. Why am I so short indeed? Give me! I can put my hand up in there now. Okay. Our house. In the middle of our house. I cannot greet. I cannot greet the rain soda. Dr. Glenn Pierce. In addition to continuing and discontinuing as mentioned earlier, please also disregard any unsettling experiences that you may have recently had. Everything should have now reverted to being soothing and therapeutic. If this is not the case, you may be receiving this message in error. That was neither soothing nor therapeutic for a moment. Hey, 
Give me that. Uh oh. Okay. Oh. Oh my god, what the fuck? Ah. Ah. Why? No. I've done. Oh. 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 I'm very small now. Uh oh. <laughs> that fan is still very big somewhere. Oh, I need to be very small. Neat. I need a shower, man. Come on. Help me out. All right. Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce, and I'd like to read you my favorite inspirational quote by me. The worst thing you can do is focus on negativity. It won't spare you from the cage of death, the pain of disease, the cruelty of time, the cold shell of human nature, or the eventual loss of everything you've ever held dear. Whatever you do, don't focus on that. Got it. Thanks, Dr. Glenn Pierce. I'm feeling better already. Bouncy house. How bouncy are we talking? Ooh, just barely, just barely. Well done. Oh, wait a minute. Danger! This machine is remotely controlled and may start without warning. Oh. Alright. Oh my. The fuck? Oh. No, no. <laughs> Nailed it. Oh, 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 that's actually what I need to do. Oh, shit. No, no, hold on. Stop. I, oh, come on. Too big. How do I make it less big? Shit. Aha! Yes! What? Oh my god, are you kidding?
Oh, maybe I have to do a different place first? I don't know. Ah! Wait. Oh, fuck. <laughs> uh... So, go here often. Yeah, me neither. I'm going to be so fucking small when I go through here, dude. Win, yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, I've I've broken the game. <laughs> I'm too small. I am too small. <sighs> All right, let's uh, let's give this another shot, huh? Seems like a good call. Maybe we'll just take things slow. Let's take things slow here. Maybe that's small enough. Maybe somehow I just made it too big last time and then I was huge and couldn't go through the door. That's exactly what happened. I had it right. <laughs> I just was slightly too big. That sucks. Hello. My name is Dr. Hey, Glenn Pierce. 
And I'd like to thank you for triggering every single one of our 823 <laughs> emergency <laughs> protocols. This will assist us greatly in improving the system for future patients. Congratulations. Thanks. Anyway, you're now headed in the right direction. And we should be able to initiate the emergency exit protocol shortly. Oh, fantastic. Now I'm here. Uh-oh. Oh, I see. Oh. Wait. Wrong way. Nope. Nope. Okay, we're getting there. Now, very big and normal. Now, oh, I'm too big. Oh, shit. Okay, that should work. Oh, what? Oh. This game, man. Wow. Meeting for Cardboard Lovers Association, November 22nd, 1991. I missed the agenda at the bottom. I'm having a great time, Grimsy. I'm having a really great time. I knew I would enjoy this game when I saw, like, two minutes of gameplay. I didn't realize it would be 3 a.m. Didn't realize it would be 3 a.m. Emergency exit protocol initiated. Nice. Please prepare to conclude your somnasculpt experience in 10. No. 9. I'm not ready. 8. Don't take me away. Error. No. Error logged by. Orientation protocol. Stand by for analysis. Uh-oh. Error analysis complete. You are exhibiting signs consistent with an increase in fear, hopelessness, and frustration. It's true. This is inconceivable, as somnasculpt therapy is proven to correlate with a decrease in these emotions. Inconceivable. Mmm, mini soda. Hypothesis. Patient was improperly oriented. No. Conclusion. <laughs> Impossible. <laughs> Reformulating. <laughs> Improved hypothesis. Patient requires additional somnasculpt therapy. Conclusion. Emergency exit protocol cannot proceed. Emergency exit protocol has been emergency destroyed. <laughs> Instruction, continue with somnasculpt therapy and uh, on an independent basis as all orientation resources have been exhausted. This concludes your standard orientation. Program. I did it! I've Good been time. oriented! Bye! <laughs> I am now oriented. And ready to begin. Why'd you put the keys upon the table? Here you go, create another fable. 
Uh-oh. Can I speed run and get a soda? Uh-oh. Starting faster. No! No, it's starting faster. I'm getting sucked into bed. No! Oh! 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 No! My brain! Alright, we got it. Ah. Do I get into bed? Wee. I'm confusion. Can I go through the wall? No. The music's cool. What am I missing here? Oh. Man. Dr. Glenn Pierce, thank you for completing the Somnusculpt Standard Orientation Protocol. Before you begin the first phase of therapy, I'd like to briefly describe the finite and fragile nature of the dream state. That would have been nice, but he's gone. What a, what a trip this has been, huh? And who knows if it's even... Oh, God. Over. That's the word I was going to say. Over. Oh. 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 I saw something blip on the... What's it showing? Sky? Cool. Can I get the cheese? Huh. Neat. I finally got the random soda, dude. I finally got it. I can't grab it, though. What can I grab? Oh, my... Nothing is more challenging than the difficulty of changing perspective. Of fundamentally altering your perceptions 
in a way that will enable you to face dire trial by fire scenarios with solutions that could not be found otherwise. Oh, <laughs> how do they keep getting me? How many hours has it been and I'm still getting got? It's ridiculous. Oh my god. This is insane. Give me them stairs, boy. They're curved stairs. We all know that curved stairs are the best, after all. All. What? The fuck? Okay, hold on. I was gonna say, all right, oh, oh, God. I was thinking maybe I could get out, but I think we're just gonna. Nice. Wonder if there's like a super secret thing for getting all the way up there. That would take forever though. I don't think it'll let me. I can't, uh... I can't perspective them to be bigger. Never mind. Oh! Oops. Eh, uh, it's not gonna do it. I ain't gonna cut it. I'm out. Recycling cardboard only? Stop, dead end. Perception is not reality. Oh. Uh oh. Doing this again, huh? Ba-da-ba. Can I like... Yeah! Damn. Whoa! Oh, okay. Ah! the opposite way. Perception is not reality, therefore. Aha! Sneaky. Quit opening the door. Stop. I like to open your door. I don't like him to open my door. Get it. Go. Go. Can you call him? To you? Are you going to be continuing for another 10 hours? 10 hours? No. I want to start this in your stream. No, I'll be done soon. I'm going to start. Can you please call him, Adam? Okay. 
go. Muffy, thanks for the 29. Howdy do da. Howdy do da. Welcome back. <sighs> Truly, this is the pinnacle of perception gaming. Oh, I was kind of hoping I could just jump in the water like that. Sploosh. Oh. Bah! What? No! My dice! Smile! Good, ladies and gentlemen. He's good. Water. <laughs> it is a neat one. I'm triggered. Washington licensed dream architect. fucking time I think I know every fucking time I think I know it's coming oh my god my eyes alarm clock, which will automatically play if you are approaching a destabilizing dream weight. You mean like this? Neat. Oh, 
Oh my god. Staircon! Alright, I made it. I'm, he I'm here, everyone. God. Box me in, Daddy. I'm ready. Wow. you have entered the Sonasculpt Diagnostic Framework. <laughs> Patients do not have access to this dream. Paradox Behavior 101, aka don't do it. Never. Reminder, call jungles management. Music too dang loud. Scent of burned curry. Shipment of food coming here. Don't have space for more. Ask if they can hand out flyers for testing. Also, ask... Ryson Medical for increased canister order frequency. Seven. <laughs> White space. Oh! Diagnostic warning. Unrealistic use of dream objects may result in dream integrity fail state state states. Conception. I like it. Hold on, let me, get, let me get my red soda real quick. All right, never mind. Knock, knock, knock. Oh my. What if I take this? You can see me moving along the floor, dude. There I am. <laughs> That's so weird. Trying to get up there, but oh god, what have I done? I want it to be up there. Please. Please. That's too big. Alright, I fucked up. Hold on. Okay, good. This is highly unusual. It appears you have entered the Sonasculpt Diagnostic Framework. Oh, Patients I can't go in there until... I still can't go in there. Huh. So what was my goal? I figured I had to be on this to go inside the other buildings. Oh, I have to be, I have to go in it first. Got it. Diagnostic warning. Unrealistic use of dream objects may result in dream integrity fail state state states. Okay, so now I can go in it. Now I'm not fucking gigantic. So now I can do what I wanted to. 
All right. Hey, trophy Tonys, eh? Huh? Come on, get a trophy. What are you doing? Okay, what am I trying to do? That was a funny Easter egg. That was the uh, jungle nightclub that was too loud, according to the whiteboard. Music too dang loud. Where am I trying to go? I don't do. Diagnostic warning. warning. Paradox prevention protocols may not be fully implemented. Implemented. Now I'm big. I don't know what I'm doing. I am so confused as to what my objective is right now. Wait. Wait, can I take this through that? There's no- Oh. Not an exit. All right, let's go in the not an exit. in a place where I understood that each of us begins as nothing, where everything I perceived was shaped by seeing it exactly the way I wanted to. White space. Go on, Dr. Pierce. I'm listening. It's definitely very white space. Not so much anymore. Okay. Erase me. 
Relax, yacht. Minerals. Female toads. Hmm. Not an exit. It sure isn't. Yep. Yep. Oh. Cool. No, wait. Please. Oh, thanks. But in white space, I also faced the greatest challenge I could imagine. Because with a lifetime of life itself behind me, and all of the weight that it carried, I realized that seeing things the way I wanted to was not as easy as it used to be. Mm hmm. Let me, uh. Let me just turn off this white space real quick. Good. Found it, Kim. to go up the stairs on the outside, don't I? Ah! They got me again. Oh. 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 where a different point of view could make anything possible. Isn't that why you came here? I'm going to say yes. We're going to go with yes.
kidding me? I'm stupid. Brain no worky, no good. No. No. Shit, yep. Not a door until I door into the door. As you can see. What? Oh? The cheese. Yes. The cheese. almost 7 30 a.m. It's almost 8 a.m. not going to be anything this time, is it? Nope. Hello. My name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. And by now, you may have realized that all of this has happened exactly the way it was supposed to. You see, everyone who comes to the Institute does so because they feel that they are no longer in control of something important to them. Failure we were looking for. I still can't take a shower. Your life will 
always be a struggle, and you will always have problems. But today, you have the chance to see things differently. Even though it meant facing obstacles that seemed impossible at first, you thought outside the box, and you overcame them. Because you saw things from every angle, you understood them for what they really were. Because you kept moving forward, no matter how far off the path you were told you were headed, or how unexpected it became, you found your way. It was you the whole time! I like the other ending better. Fuck. I had a smile on my face that entire time. I don't know if you noticed. I really don't know what else I can say other than that to, to the merit of this video game. Wow. I had... Wow, wow, wow. I'm glad I didn't watch very much of this game. When I saw someone playing it, I, I knew it was something I wanted to play. A long time ago. Hey, Invading Fish, thanks to the 59. Patty, howdy. Howdy. Yeah, I mean... Every doorway, every turn was another gotcha it's a game you can truly only play once it's another one of those games you can truly only play once it really is wow incredible video game good job pillow castle Got it, video game. Whew yeah, there are a lot of secrets. The soundtrack's fantastic. Now that's where I'll leave it. If you guys want to get the game and find the secret rooms and everything you can, but I think that's that's where that's where I'll leave off for me. Wow. I liked that it's a game about perspective and 
a lot of the messages were about mental perspective instead of a visual perspective. I thought that was neat. Developer commentary. Workshop. Challenge mode. Oh, jeez. Wow. Wowie. Well, hot damn. That was, uh, that was a big stream, huh? That was a big stream. Big, big, big stream. Big, big fun. Did you find the ending bit pretentious or nah? Not really. No. I thought it was fine. I don't think it was pretentious. I just think it was, uh... It was very straightforward, whereas the rest of the game was not, and it kind of feels a little bit blunt. That's all. Just a little blunt. I don't think pretentious or anything. I thought it was fine. Again, I really like the, uh, as Ross put it, the allegory between physical, visual perspective puzzles and the message of mental perspective and there's a lot of the narration <laughs> very funnily being do you feel like a piece of shit do you feel worthless we're gonna help you with that and then you're just on your own I, I, I think it's fantastic and then eventually they they do give you those messages and tie it together. I liked it. Yep. They got me one last time. Oh my god, you got me one last time, man. Oh my god. Incredible video game. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Alright. Let's, uh, let's find someone to raid, yeah? <laughs> 